everyone today i'll be making chin 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 is a nigerian snack which is loved by everyone both adults and kids so what are the ingredients we need we need two and a half cup of flour which is about 256 grams we need butter quarter cup of butter about 55 grams we need sugar quarter cup of sugar which is about 50 grams and we need quarter cup of milk which is 60 ml we need one beaten egg, salt, and baking powder. So let's get started. We add our flour to the bowl. We have to sieve it to remove any lump. And we add our butter to it. So before starting, we add the milk to the sugar. This is to dissolve our sugar completely so that we won't have any lump when mixing it. And we set this aside. Then we add in quarter teaspoon of baking powder. And also quarter teaspoon of salt then we mix it together fold everything that you don't have to see any grain of butter at all after properly mixing it then our milk and sugar that is well dissolved will be added to the flour mixture and also the beaten egg then we mix together After mixing it so well, then we cover this with a plastic film and set aside for 10 minutes. Then we come back to cut our dough. Ready? And then we transfer it to the flour surface. Make sure you use very little or no flour at all. Then you need a little again. Then divide this into two. And we need this with a rolling pin. You can roll this to be about quarter inch thickness. So after doing that, you could use a pizza cutter or a knife. And we shape it to be a triangle. You could use a pizza cutter or a knife. Then we form our dough into sort of a triangle. And today I will be making two types of shapes. So now we cut our dough to like one inches wideness after doing that then we take one and then cut this way my kids so much love this design 
and that is why I want to teach you how to do that today. After doing that, just take a piece, make a hole in the middle, and continue this way. Then you take it up, open up, and then fold it in and bring it out. And then let's try it again. Open it up, then bring it in, and then out. And we keep doing this for all the... So this is the normal shape we are used to in Nigeria. All you have to do is to use your pizza cutter or your knife to cut a straight line. After then, then you go horizontally again, all through. And now our changing is ready. So all you have to do is to pull it up. And it is all ready to be fried. So now let's go over to fry our chinchin. Very generous amount of oil into a frying pan. Make sure the oil is oil but not extremely oil. And gently pour in your chinchin. Make sure you pour the two at a time because you want them to have enough space to fry. Keep frying at intervals because you don't want to have one part brown and the other one the lighter version. So you keep stirring until it is done and your desired brownness is found. Now this Shade of brownness is okay for me. Then I will drain off the changing from the hole. Hey. Now the chinchi is ready. You can see how beautiful it is. This is the spiral shape and this is the normal shape so this is going down with a bottle of coca-cola so make sure you like my video comment and subscribe because more recipes are still coming on this channel thank you